Uh, welcome in the chair. I'm your host, Joe Scro, and I'm on the set of Julio, where we are filming our pilot episode, Trifecta. And with me in the chair here, we have Chuck French, who plays Jose. How you doing, Chuck? Hey, doing pretty well. Great. Great. We're glad, too. So now, you, Chuck, actually, Jose plays the owner of the shop. Uh, and tell us a little bit about Jose, uh, why Jose owns this shop and how he came about to own it. Well, Jose is a guy that uh, he'd rather be doing something else with his life, but uh, from what I understand, Jose is uh, sort of thrust into this position. He, in, I mean, he wants to own the barber shop, but he has dreams of a better life, so he tries to make the best of it w with what he has. Mm -hmm. And what about this interest in drawing that he has? Where that is that like childhood thing, or is that maybe one of those things that he wants to develop? Well, he'd love to be a professional artist, but like many artists, it's hard to make a full-time living in that regard. So. He does it pretty much as a hobby. He's been doing it ever since he was a kid, and he still enjoys it now. Now, one of the things I heard about your characters, he's uh, basically at home. He's like a whip man. I guess he has his name. He's a spineless amoeba. And uh, you're recently in a film where you actually portrayed a little bit of the opposite of that, I mean, more like the villain on Greater Threat. Now, can you tell us a little bit about the transition going from a, a role like that to a comedy role? Uh, is that something you find easy, or is that more like uh, you, is there one type of uh, role you feel like you fit more into a little easier? Well, I mean, my goal as an actor is to be versatile, and I'm still, you know, striving to be versatile in that. So, I mean, I love the role of Jose because it is a change from what I'm used to uh, playing. I do a lot of dramatic roles and feature films and all of that, and this is the first sitcom that I've ever been in, first comedy. So it's definitely a challenge for me. I, I'm enjoying it. I love it. Uh, well, I, I, I appreciate that. I, I appreciate that. I'm having a lot of fun with the character of Jose and um, just doing the best I can. Hey, pendejos, chill. Uh, what? It's an expression, man. A cornudo is the victim of an unfaithful lover. Yeah, well, I guess that'd be me. And thanks for the Spanish version of my life. Hey, no problem, many time. So, uh, what did you say your girlfriend's name was? Do you see your character right now, Jose, having room to be developed a little more? If so, like in what areas do you want to see him developed? Obviously, you know, it's just a pilot episode, but do you see little glimmers of things you'd like to push a little further at some point in future episodes? Yeah, I, I believe Jose has a multifaceted personality. I think he's fairly deep. I mean, it. it in this pilot episode, he looks, I think, somewhat shallow and, and all of that, for, and, and he's very comical, I think. But uh, I think there's more to him that will be brought out in future episodes, and I'm, I'm looking forward to portraying that. You're for the challenge, we're, we're looking forward to seeing you in them. Uh, thanks a lot. We'll, we'll be seeing you a lot, I'm sure, in the future. And that'll wrap it up for this edition of In the Chair.